rocks. So what is this? Ibanez guitars. Ibanez guitars. Hi, Sam. Hi, everybody. Helmut uh, here. Konrad here. <laughs> uh, Helmut. <laughs> um, Today, very strange stuff. I'm totally surprised. I've never seen you with Ibanez guitars. No. Uh, uh, I have to think. Maybe some 30 years ago I had a little written hour. Was it the Ibanez? Oh, man. Yeah, yeah. Kind of... Uh, Three, three, five. Yes, yeah. <laughs> but it got stolen. <laughs> so, uh, never had any Ibanez, no. Uh, but this new AZ series, A -Z, yeah. a friend of mine told me, a little bit more direction F style. Mm -hmm. uh, not this typical Ibanez uh, neck and, and, and. Uh, jam, Steve Vai stuff, or uh, Satriani stuff, they are more like a, let's say, sir, or Fender. Uh, very, very, uh, yes, a very natural feeling neck. And it's a roasted. Roasted maple neck, very, very cool. Yeah, I like Seems this nice. roasted style, it's very modern. Never had one, but it's cool. It's cool. Uh, what what the best thing ever are the lumin lumi don't know what is it but the, but the, they are luminescent <laughs> <laughs> very very good dots you see them very very good I I I, I'm, I want them on all my guitars okay you can see them in the dark yes you play a lot in the dark yes <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> on a, on a, no, my 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 old time horror uh, is it is dark on stage and I begin a song and I don't see the neck. I have to see the neck. Really? Yes. Only for to get uh, to, to to so now I am safe. But if I don't see the ne neck and the dots, I'm I'm not feeling uh, very comfortable. Mm -hmm. Not Stevie Wonder. <laughs> or Jeff Healy. Jeff Healy. Yes. No, but what else had to, uh, have we? Uh, yes, I have to say that's the Japanese series, mm -hmm. that's the Indonesia series. Yeah. It's a little bit cheaper, I think that's about. Yeah, but Indonesia is a pretty nice country. I've been there. Okay. It's <laughs> very nice. I've been to Japan. Okay. No, we have to go to Indonesia sometimes okay, with people rocks. Maybe so, by the way. After this uh, uh, episode. Yeah, maybe, but we need more subscribers, so we tell you First people of all, now, yes. please subscribe to the channel. We want to go to Pari Pari next time, and uh, please <laughs> uh, subscribe and buy a t-shirt. Yeah, um, yeah and this and is Indonesia see, yeah. made, and this one is made in Japan. Japan, and that's a little uh, more expensive. Mm -hmm. uh, the specs are... Very similar. Blocking tuners, uh, a Goto tram, I think it's not bad. This one I like. 
the pickup, of course, configuration is different. It's two hundred. Seymour packets. Duncan pickups. Yeah, yeah, special ones, Seymour Duncans on every okay. model. And we both, uh, both guitars have this splitter. It's a very cool uh, feature in the down position. It's it's like a normal HSS, mm -hmm. and in the up position you have every combination you can think of. Uh, I shortly will demonstrate. That's the normal. <laughs> It's very normal HSS, but uh, toggle switch up and there begins the fun with every combination you can think of. <laughs> This one I like most because that's in this position I have the possibility for one mm. single coil on the bridge what I like. Well, it sounds and good. It, it sounds, sounds good and, and down is always the humbucker. Even if you have this this uh, this uh, switch yes, in this yes. that position. Uh, so you can make a, I I would do it a preset that would be single coil. And Very hot, mm -hmm. very hot pickup, but it's great, it's cool. In okay. this case it's it's similar, but I don't know how the combination... Me not either, but uh, I think this is a five point switch. Yeah. So if you're in this position, it's the humbucker. And then it's single coil combination. <laughs> Maybe a serial, or I don't know. Neck, humbucker, split it, like. And toggle switch? I don't know. Let's figure. Uh, let's check it out. But what you can get out of two humbuckers, you can do it with this yeah. electronic. Yeah, and this uh, this tremolo. This I, I like the it. same I, tremolo. I, yeah, yeah. It's a so good what one. I like on this Ibanez guitars, I have two two jams. I had some mm -hmm. universe guitars, a lot of Ibanez guitars. I'm an Ibanez user. But with the Floyd Rose. Uh, with Floyd Rose, yeah. but they have this uh, kind of. That's cool. Yeah, yeah that's cool. That's because cool. I like it, it get, gets out and in and it works good. And it stays in position when yeah. you turn air, that's cool. That's and cool. they got this uh, nice um, part here, so mm -hmm. you can adjust the tremolo. That's, that's very no, cool. they're very well made. There's, there's uh, another difference, that's an older body, and I think that's uh, what is a base root body. Yeah. Okay. And this one has uh, 24 frets, this is 22. So that's more yeah. the vintage style and that's more from in between. But this is much more expensive than this one. Yeah, 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 double the price. Right. Mm -hmm. But so. really cool, as so I have to say, from the feeling yeah. it's, it's, it's a cool working guitar. Mm -hmm. really yeah, cool. I like the, the style, the color, everything. So maybe we do some even this guitar in the future? Yes, there are some uh, interesting models coming, I think, uh, next month, the, the various, uh, the signature ones. Okay. I, I, I think I'm very uh, uh, excited about this Andy Timmons model. Ah, oh, this looks like a, a Real yeah, yeah. Because that's the only, I, I think, the only model with, with three single coil pickups. Yeah, yeah. And it looks like a, a 57, right? Yes, yeah. Yeah, it's a little more, but I'm sure that's good. And, and the other interesting model is this, uh, Mark, what is his name, Martin Miller, the German, yeah. uh, a very good guitar player. Mm. And he has a some Les Paul-ish model, ah. because with a, 
with a uh, uh, maple on on mahogany and the mm. maple. Uh, yeah, let's see. The, the, uh, I think a little more pricey, mm. but I'm sure they are also good. So near future we get maybe uh, Helmut Bieber, Ivanist model. Oh, <laughs> and if so, what would you like to get? No, I'm a uh, direction anti Timons. What I heard till now from his demoing, uh, he, uh, he he plays it. Uh, that's nearest to my favorite style, that's a Strat. And uh, I have to say, I would change the pickup. For my very personal taste, I prefer the, the weaker pickups. But in this case, it's cool because there's no, there's no uh, pedal running. <laughs> If I engage the King of the Horn, Perfect. Yeah. Really easy to. It's a very good. Uh, it stays in tune very well. Yeah. Really cool. A, a really good uh, working guitar. If you have, a, if you play some uh, job, let's say, where you have different styles, I think that's that's the answer. So. For me, my top 40 band, I, yes. I need one. <laughs> my jazz top 40 band. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, um, yeah. Finally, after the word jazz, we finish this episode. <laughs> Let's do some no jazzy uh, yeah. tune. Yeah, we should do one. In E minor, I think. E minor, yes. And um, yeah, see you next time at Beaver Rocks. <laughs>